All right, guys, so we are going to demonstrate in this video the backup assist that the 2022 Tundra has. Now, don't go commenting, oh, it's such a small trailer. If you've trailered, you know that backing up a small trailer is the biggest pain in the butt ever, and they are very easy to jackknife. So at first, I'm going to back it up without the assist on, and then I will turn the assist on and try to back the trailer up with that and see if there's a difference. I set up my tripod over here so you guys can tell and you guys can let me know down in the comment section. So we will get into it. And it already has our camper loaded because of the garage that the truck has. We'll turn down the AC and then we will put it in reverse. And we already have the trailer and everything there. And we'll just back it up. Oh my gosh, I'm turning the steering wheel so much just trying to stay straight. All right, so I'm good. So I'm going to go back and hopefully you guys can tell with the other camera just how much I was moving around. So we're straightening her back out. Sorry. I was talking. Good there? All right, I'm gonna put it back in park. And then I don't mind if you talk. You can talk the whole time, it's fine. Okay, now, process is, you see the switch that has the trailer? Just yep. yes, push that down. All right, push it down. When you push that, this comes up on the MID. Okay. Tells you the type of trailer. Mm-hmm. So we'll go ahead and press continue because that's what we want to do. And the screen populates. Okay. Now, when you put the vehicle into reverse, see the lower icons? Right down here? Yeah, the yeah. one all the way to the right will light up. Okay. And then what you want to do, it's a trailer, it's an outline of a trailer. So toggle it on? Toggle it on. Okay. Gotcha. That engages Whoa. the Whoa! Okay. And the steering wheel just turned itself. Yeah. Is that based on because of how I position the truck? What it does is that uh, the camera is uh, focused on the tongue okay. of the trailer. Gotcha. And uh, if it's you know a certain degree from straight, it will instantly turn the wheel where it needs to go to keep the trailer going straight. So the truck okay. follows the trailer. So the camera from the tailgate or yes. from the cab? Well, it actually uses both. Of both? Them. Okay. Uh, but it, it mainly utilizes the one from the, uh, the tailgate. Gotcha. So guys, the camera it's using from the tailgate and the cab of the truck too, because when, when I engage that system, it just snapped the steering wheel. So just keep it in reverse and just let her go and don't touch the steering wheel. You, you can touch it just to see how it's working. Right. You can leave your hand off. Okay. My hand is completely off. And as you guys can see, it's going straight. That's incredible. And I'm sure it's so much more straight than how I was doing it. That's crazy. So then we'll turn it off and go forward. Dang, that's really cool. 
So yeah, guys, let, let me know if I did it better or if the truck did it better. I feel like the truck definitely had significantly less effort to do it than I did. So that was a very cool demo, guys. Um, I did ask that if you wanted to turn the trailer, like to position it somewhere else, the truck will literally, or the system will follow the trailer itself. So if you are wanting to park it into a spot and then you let go of the steering wheel, like if you take over, then the truck will continue to just follow the trailer on its own. So very, very cool feature. I can't wait to see the footage to see how much better the truck did than me because it's a tiny little trailer and I had it going all over the place like a fish. Uh, and then the truck, I mean, you saw the steering wheel just snapping around. It was absolutely awesome. So if you guys are new around here, definitely consider subscribing. Returning subscribers, as always, I appreciate your guys' support and I will catch you in the next video. All right, see you later. Thank you.